Why do you want to do root cause analysis? Folks, it's the difference between using a shotgun versus a sniper's rifle, okay? When you have a problem in your machine and you start tweaking knobs and changing settings, right? I have seen machines get to a point where they just won't run because we tried everything yeah. and we get to and do what we did. Isn't it much better? Or every that? shift changing that because they know yeah. better. Because they know better, right? <laughs> you come in and shift time. Yeah. And, uh, and what you find is, is people will tell you, I don't want to do a root cause analysis because it's painful, man, right? You got to spend a lot of time in a conference room and, uh, talking to people and asking questions and getting numbers. And I'm like, I'd rather spend six hours in a conference room gathering information, right? Uh, getting the root cause down to two or three probable causes and then go out and execute, then spend eight hours playing with the settings on this machine, watching a puke product back and forth, and have to go back to center line anyway to begin the process. So the this approach is much more efficient.